YouTube, ano George here, eto na naman ang isa sa ating UK Calye serye May video tayo habang uh, ito, nagda-drive ako, palapas ako ng motorway ano? um, Doon sa isa namin mga videos about you know, UK Calye serye uh, May nagtanong about uh, buying a car dito sa UK So Tama nga naman, UK Calye Serie, hindi naman pala namin na-discuss yun. <laughs> so, eto na, gawin natin yan. About buying a car in the UK. So, Are you an overseas qualified nurse who would like to take the first step of registration with the NMC? Well, one way to do that is by achieving four grade Bs on the Occupational English Test. OET is a language exam with an emphasis on real situations UK medical staff encounter on a daily basis. Here at IELTS Medical, we have qualified native English OET trained tutors who are ready, willing and able to provide you with the best learning experience. We've seen lots of EU and overseas qualified nurses through to a first time OET pass and we'd like to do the same for you. Inquire today about how we can assist you too. So, dito sa UK, first things first, alam na kung hindi nyo napapansin, compared sa Pilipinas, nagda-drive kami with the driver's side nasa kanan and we drive on the left side of the road. So, just to get that one clear, no? Parang, ewan ko tama yung term, right hand drive ba dito? Parang gano'n. Uh, so, that, now that's out of the way. Um, ano naman, uh, when you're buying a car dito sa UK, um, there's two ways to do that. Nandiyan ang higher purchase. Bibilin mo outright, whether that's through financing or meron ka ng spot cash, bilin mo. Or yung tinatawag na uh, personal contract plan or PCP. So, ang idea is yung residual value ng auto mo after X amount of years, usually 2 or 3 years, yung value nun gagamitin ang pang down dun sa bagong kotse, PCP ulit. Pero obviously dito, yung initial purchase mo, ano na yun, meron kang down payment na X amount. So, it has pros and cons. Uh, nasa sa yan kung whatever fits you. So, talking about uh, brand new versus second hand, ob obviously, pag brand new, uh, wala masyadong sakit yan. Um, may warranty. Some, uh, some car manufacturers dito sa UK, they offer as much as 7 years na car warranty, no? So, tingnan nyo yun. At uh, wala ka rin yung tinatawag na MOT until after 3 years old na yung auto mo. So, ano yung MOT? Dito sa UK, lahat ng kotse nag mot after their 3 years uh, of age nila. nila. And uh, uh, it's a shortened term for Ministry of Transport. Bale, chinecheck nila ika nga sa nurse uh, head to toe assessment yan ng auto uh, titignan kung roadworthy pag hindi na roadworthy yung auto mo may problema sa makina may problema sa, sa kung ano man yung kotse mo kailangan na siyang ipajunk yun so it's a good way to maintain cars dito ngayon Obviously, kung brand new auto mo, hindi mo ipag-iisipin Hindi mo pa iisipin yun until after 3 years <coughs> Now, paano naman kung uh, second hand? Well, kung second hand, uh, kagandahan, obviously, second hand Most of the time, mas mura ang second hand um, Then, ang isa pa is Obviously, meron din mga financing options But ma medyo mas madali Kaya lang, the danger of buying a second hand I always just say is maganda may alam ka ng konti sa kotse at the same time, kung makakabili ka sa reputable seller whether sa kasa or garage dito, no? garage, garage, wow <laughs> hindi garage, garage dito sa UK, garage or uh, kasa or uh, at least reputable seller better, 
kasi minsan pag tao sa tao minsan mahirap din na bumit isa sa mga pinaka magandang gauge kung ang sasakyan is gamit na you always go by the number of mileage no? uh, kung lalo na kung second hand car kasi uh, kung ang kotse tumakbo ng 10,000 miles per year say halimbawa 3 years old na yung kotse maganda sana under 30,000 miles siya kasi kung over 30,000 miles gamit na gamit yung auto ayan Alright, so... Hello, titos and titas of UK. Nagpapadala ka ba sa Pilipinas? Pero nagbabayad ka pa ng fees? At nagpupunta ka pa sa office? O di kaya kailangan mo pang tumawag? Well, let me introduce you Tap Tap Send. Tap Tap Send is all in the app. Napakadali lang. And wala ng fees. Yes, you heard me right. Wala ka nang babayaran pa. At mataas papalitan. So, ang kagandahan niyan... Pag ginamit niyo pa ang aming code, which is Pinoy UK, you get an extra 15 pounds on your first padala. Yes, you heard it right. 15 pounds, which is over uh, 1,000 pesos na libre. Basta gamitin niyo lang ang aming code na Pinoy UK on your first padala with tap tap send. So, ano pang hinihintay mo? Mag tap tap ka na. Ayun. So, ang tanong, uh, Manong George, anong, anong kotse dinadrive mo dyan sa UK? So, I drive two cars, yung isa, a company car. So, company ko na yung pinagtatrabuhan, employer ko na yung may bahala doon. So, wala naman tayong ano doon. It's a good car. Itong family car namin, it's a Japanese import. Ayan, ito, hindi masyado din discuss uh, Bakit Japanese import? Uh, kasi itong Japanese import na to, van ito, na 8-seater. And, uh, dito sa UK, mahal ang 8-seater at bihira siya. Uh, so, I went the Japanese route sa aking research kasi una, uh, mura siya, afford siya, at the same time, yung space, di ba? Kasi ang pinakamurang brand new 7-seater, 7 lang ha, 7-seater, na, na, na nakita ko sa UK at this time nung nag-research ako, uh, 30,000 pounds more or less. Uh, so, sabi ko, teka lang masyadong mahal yun. Uh, so ayun, nag-research ako But again, dapat You do your checks Kung pwede kang kumuha ng third party uh, Na mag-review ng auto Gawin nyo kasi that's what I did Para sa peace of mind namin And so, ayan, nagkaroon kami ng Family car na malaki Kasya kami lahat At the same time, afford namin But, I have to say uh, And this is true Dahil second hand na to, may edad na yung auto Marami rin siyang Hindi naman sakit, pero Mas madalas mo siyang ipapaservice, papacheck Kasi yun nga, uh, may edad na yun sa sakit Alright, and sana meron kayo natutunan about buying cars dito sa UK uh, Nagbigay tayo ng iba't ibang options So again, kung meron kayong mga tanong pa sa about sa UK uh, May gusto kayong puntahan namin Basta kaya namin maabot, no? hindi masyadong malayo Well anyway, kahit saan, basta kaya namin If time would allow Walang problema, punta natin and we'll give you an honest review. And so with that, always remember, Manong Knows. Manong knows best, put you always to rest when staying in the United Kingdom. Manong knows best.